Here's where the issue begins. NDOT has closed down State Route 156 and is detouring people up Route 56. When people get a couple of miles up the road, a detour sign tells them to continue straight if they want to get to Highway 156. But that's not what Google Maps tells them. Turn left onto Dibble Road. Google Maps detours the detour down Little Dibble Road, a narrow, windy road that forces people into the shoulder when they pass one another. Since we've been standing here, we've probably seen 10 cars go by. What do you normally get in a day? About 10 cars. Total? Yeah, if you're, if that. And I mean, now we've got hundreds. Yeah. This guy's moving along. Yeah. What are we doing, about 35, 40? Oh, every bit of that. What's the speed limit here? 25. <laughs> Darren Bounds already lost a pet duck on the road last week, and he's not the only one experiencing problems. Joyce Blackson says she saw an 18-wheeler head down the road the other day. I'm like, are you kidding me? I think he wiped out every branch. He went down that little narrow hill. There is no way. If there'd been a car flying down through there, it'd been all she wrote. They'd went over. We called and emailed Google Maps but did not receive a response. To be fair, Apple Maps routes people the same way. The Waze GPS does not, though. It has people follow the proper detour. We spoke with the Indiana Department of Transportation about the issue. Shouldn't NDOT notify Waze and Google Maps and Maps to let them know where people should be routed? Right. So that is definitely something that we can always look into um, if we receive reports of that. We're notifying you. We will definitely notify um, people here at NDOT, um, our, our team um, that that can look into this and um, reach out, reach out to those to those um, apps. The people who live on Double Road will only have to deal with this problem until construction is done. That is, until the next construction project starts on 156. Outside of Rising Sun, Indiana, David Winter, back to you. You can always get local stories right here on YouTube, but go ahead and hit that subscribe button to get notifications to stay in the know.